I saw the sands being made and I saw the strips being cut and they were just wonderful. For someone that makes things with your hands, it's, it's amazing to see how the strip is actually produced. Then I found, found Timbing Corsi at the beachfront. I saw him cutting there and I started talking to him and gradually ordered some strips from him. Together we made, one, we made this piece for, it was for Absolute Vodka, it was a promotion in the Cosmopolitan, where he cut the rubber, I had to sort of help him to get this, the shape of the Absolute Bottle right, and then I did the beads and the, the settings. He understood exactly, I said, you know, now cut the rubber, some patterns and put some nice bottles all in a row, and he took artistic license and did bottles like that. So then I had to cut it like this and show him, no, do it, a bit like this or a bit like that. And then this is just a photo that I took of that necklace. These are the latest bangles. It's the latest development where instead of cutting through the black to get to the white, we cut just into the white and it just becomes much more sophisticated. And the same with the key rings, also a very late development. Initially I just took off cuts and just put some loops on them. And then after having bought a, a thing for putting in studs and so on, I could put studs in like this and all of a sudden I'm starting to get to more three-dimensional richer shapes. I picked up a number plate made some bangles from it and this guy from Eziba saw those and he fell in love with them as well. So fortunately I had another order that I could deliver and that I sold 500 of these to them. He paid me at 14 Rand to the dollar so I just made lots of money.